Jeff here with Shrepper the Seed Company. Today we're going to talk about why this fescue, which is Emerald 3 from Sharp Brothers, why this fescue looks so dark brown. And as you can see, it's extremely short. And you can tell right here from these blades of grass that this is what it looks like. It looks chopped off, brown on top, and very choppy right here on the very top of this. Unfortunately, we had a malfunction with the lawnmower when this was mowed um, about three days ago, and uh, the deck was lowered way, way, way too short, as you can see. Um, we're about June 22nd in 2016 here, and this is pretty much in the middle of heat of the summer. Some lawns look like this because of they are in stress and because of the drought, because of not getting any rain, but this grass here was actually cut way too short for one, and two, it was cut by a dull blade. The reason why it was cut by a dull blade is because when the grass is choppy, like my fingers here, you see where they're all uneven? It should be cut like this, straight across. And so when the grass is actually cut by the lawnmower, it takes a clean off. When it's cut and rippled like this, that means that the grass blade was dull and it actually ripped the top of the grass off instead of cutting it like it should have. So as you can see from the yard, it looks pretty bad. It's got a lot of yellow spots in it. Um, there is some spots that are coming up that are getting greener, but mostly it's pretty much yellow and looks not very good. So take it from the operator that done this. Please raise your decks up at least an inch to two inches during the summertime, during the heat of the summer, that it will really, really help your fescue be a lot greener and not look as and yellow as this In the last does. video, we showed you uh, what it looks like when you don't do very good maintenance on your grass. Today, we're going to show you another yard that's directly across the street from where we were at. Um, this is at the church in Healy, and this grass is the same type it was across the road, which is our Emerald Sport Blend. It has a uh, turf type tall fescue, as you can see here from the, let's see if I can get one here, the thicker leaves. And then it also has the um, bluegrass in it, which is the thinner leaves. So here's a comparison basically of the, the bluegrass and the tall turf type fescue. Um, the reason why we have the bluegrass and the fescue mixed in together is because as you can see they make a very good uh, durable yard. This yard gets played in pretty much all summer long by the kids and as you can see it's very very well groomed and looks really nice. One of the things that I showed you on the last segment was is how good or how bad the, the buffalo grass was cut or the I'm sorry the fescue was cut. As you can tell by this blade of grass here, it's almost straight across. There's hardly any brown at the top of this uh, fescue blade. And as we said before, the best cut as you can have is a nice sharp blade that cuts right across the grass and actually cuts it and not pulls it. If the tops of your grass look really, really brown like it did in the past video, basically you're going to get the shards where it actually pulled the grass when it, when it tried to cut it. And that is obviously due to um, your blades being dull or uh, you mowing too fast with your lawnmower will do that same thing. So we wanted to show you what an actual good green lush yard looked like. So that's what we have here. If you have any further questions, you can call us at 1-800-462-8483. Comment below or check out our website at sharpseed.com.